Hey everyone, it is Char from Char's Fashion Nation. I hope my microphone's going to get it up. Yeah. Yes, I have colored my hair. I colored those roots. My medication does a job on me. Speaking of a job, I wish FedEx would have done a better job on delivering my box from Fabric Mart. Yes, <laughs> this bill is my fabric mark mail. Uh, this, I didn't know was out there. Nobody knocked. Nobody, you know, doorbell. Um, nobody did that. I really hope there's nothing damaged. Because this is soaking wet. It's so soaking wet outside. I now have to change my socks because I left this sitting on a step, not up on by the door. Like, be serious. This is full of fabric. That's why it says fabric mark on the actual label. But they put it label facing down. Still, again, not a good thing. Um, but I was waiting for this. And let's just poof, see what's in the box. This is a fabric. Oh, this is so soft. Oh, you guys are going to get that voice for me. This is so soft. <laughs> oh, this is a jersey fabric. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. And again, from Fabric Mart, they did give you washing instructions. Um,. Oh my gosh, I could, no, don't worry, I have, look at that, isn't that beautiful? I'm excited to use this. Um, let's see, somebody's sending me a message here. Okay. Um, that was my friend telling me how far away from the house he is. Um. I'm so excited because look, zippers, my friend, zippers, zippers. I'm excited for this. Oh, there's my yellow fabric. Oh, you know what this is for? That yellow dress challenge. I have my yellow fabric. That's not the only yellow fabric that I have. Oh, I'm excited for this. Um, and then I did get this. I thought this was a rather nice peachy fabric. We'll go over all these fabrics again because I have to redo. Oh, that's going to work. Okay, that's only one of the threads that I got. Here's the one that's 3,000 yards. So excited for this. Oh, so, so excited. Why does this not look like all the fabric I ordered? Hmm. Unless I ran out of a fabric. That's okay with me. But this is so beautiful. I I had to order. Oh, it's so silky soft. Ooh, I love that. Now, there are some other ones in here that I'm very excited to show you. Very, very excited. I have an idea for this and it's summer projects it's not just tank tops because that is a rib knit it is indeed I love how they have their washing instructions on there buttons <laughs> I love it. buttons oh <sighs> love my buttons Indeed. Okay. I did say that I got a fabric that I got 10 yards of. And this is it. Isn't this beautiful? Now, I know Viv Mom is going to be up at Fabric Mart this weekend. 
No hard feelings, sweetie. Let's just leave that in the past. Um, but maybe it's a good thing that Garbage Mart put this in there because who knows what would have happened to it. Now, there's supposed to be two panels of this, and I'm hoping that there is. If there isn't, I will have to call them and ask them where the other panel is because I believe that they could just fold the two panels together and I would have no problem with that. But this is only one. I'm going to have to give them a jingle. Um, and I'll let them know I only received one panel. But they did say there would be two panels because this is only sold by the panel. But I'll just give them a jingle later and let them know that I only got the one panel of it and see what was up with that and maybe they can replace that with another one. But you know what? I'm not mad at that. This is like, this is beautiful. Um, now in the picture it actually looks like a bunch of hand sewn um, embroidery on here. And so that's what I thought would be going on with this. But indeed, it is a print. It is not a hand embroider or machine embroider. And in the picture, they even look on here, would that not almost look like something embroidered if I just held it back here? Almost. Um, now, I've seen Angela Clayton with the actual one with the actual embroidery going on. Now this is just a print with a print of that. Still, I'm not mad at that. It's a beautiful fabric. It really is. This is going to have uses. Absolutely, this is going to have uses. Um, or unless they had this this way and I don't know I'll have to give them a jingle and find out but anyway if you're interested in the Viv Mom meet and greet that's this weekend up at Fabric Mart I won't be able to go because I don't have a room see it says sold by the panel only and there's only one panel in here so I will have to give Fabric Mart a jingle about that to let them know I only got one of the two panels that I paid for. Whoops. Whoops. Because it did say on my uh, list that there was two panels of that and I paid some moolah for all these fabrics. That's why I felt like something's missing. You know? Unless of course there was another box that didn't get delivered with the rest of my fabric in it. Now, listen, that's a possibility. It is a possibility that that may have happened or it could be out in the mailbox in an envelope or something. Um, which, again, they would have to uh, let me know this. Hold on, Rocco's calling. Hello, Rocco. What are you doing? Uh, 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 oh, you just got done with your kayak sale. So, how's the weather in Florida today? So that's how that is. So it's like it's so cold in Florida that you can wear a tank top. <laughs> okay. So 
so you were over at your cousin's house. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, yeah, that does sound kind of grungy. So. <laughs> Actually, have you on the phone while I'm making a YouTube video? <laughs> but you're not on speaker. <laughs> yes, Fabric Mart. Except for they forgot one of my panels of fabric. Now, it's where you took me before. That three hour drive. It's not far from Reading. Yeah, that one. Yeah, yeah, that. The Amish paradise is all over the place out there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that place. <laughs> yes, that place. Now, um, YouTube creator Angela Clayton has been to Fabric Mart several times. And then Viv Mom from Viv Mom says is supposed to be up there for a meet and greet this weekend. Ah, okay. Well, yes. 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 Yeah. And one of the fabrics that I got is imported from Italy. No. Made in Italy. No. Made in Italy. Yeah. Yeah, hold on. Everybody stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, and as always, stay blessed. And hold on. Say bye, Rocco. Bye, Rocco. <laughs> <laughs> he may live in Florida now. Now I have you on speaker. He may live in Florida now, but so we still talk, don't we? Yep. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> how, much, uh, how much fun have you been having? I've been having a ball. He, he found his new place to hang out. <laughs> hey, ha how's the uh, the soup with the uh, when you dip your shrimp into it? Oh, uh, the conch chowder. Yeah. Oh my God, people, if you're listening, if you get shrimp from a restaurant, seafood restaurant, or whatever, you get some you peel shrimp. Get yourself a bowl of conch chowder to put it. Dip your shrimp in soup. Don't use the cocktail sauce. Says Just to get that the chowder. Just use it with, just dip it in the chowder in the broth, in your conch chowder. And it is such a different taste. It's like, mm, 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 good. He says it's beyond deliciousness-ness-ness. No. Yes. Yeah. Thus. Well, <laughs> I told her what she said. She's like, you're the first person to tell me that. I said, oh my God, I said, this is a feast. I said, next time I'm coming, coming in here, I'm going to get the shrimp, and I'm going to get the conch chowder. 
Mm -hmm. I don't want to see no cocktail sauce. And if anybody comes down to where uh, you're at, where's the best place to get a kayak? Uh, one of the places to get a kayak. Maybe one of All the right. best, but... Where's one of uh, the places to stop and get a kayak? Keys Kayak LLC in yeah. Marathon, Florida. Yeah. Right, right by the airport. Right at the east end of Marathon Airport. Right across the street. Yeah. At the end of the, the, end of the airport. Yes. Yeah. And it's conveniently located near Circle K. Where you can get fresh ground coffee. Other than the fact that I freshly grind my coffee every morning. <laughs> yeah, Circle K is down here. You go up to the machine, and you push the button by the machine what size, what size cup you want. Uh, of course, you pick your cup, put your cup in thing um, then you pick the, uh, the type of coffee you want and there, there's coffee beans and the machine grinds the coffee up yes. in the machine for you so it's fresh ground coffee yeah so each serving is freshly ground freshly made yeah it's, it's, it's okay coffee it's, it's good coffee uh, I still won't say it's up to par with Wawa coffee. Well, no, I found Death Wish to be better than Wawa. Yeah, I still like my Wawa. Wawa's good. But once you've had Death Wish, no other coffee matters. Uh, <laughs> Rocco's not a huge fan of Death Wish because he's used to cheap coffee. <laughs> I like my fancy Einstein coffee. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Something that he can dump a bunch of sugar in and milk or creamer. I'm still trying to finish my second cup of coffee I made this morning. <laughs> That's why I'm trying to sit down here and relax. I'm going to drink my coffee, then jump in the shower and take a quick nap. Yeah. Because and get he, he gets grungy down there. Um, in Florida, um, because you know, hey, moving kayaks around makes you sweaty. Uh, you know, it's salt in the air sticks to you, sand gets all over you. Yeah, you don't want to be like, salty with the uh, sand, <laughs> uh, salty sand scrub. Uh, you don't want the sand getting your uh, cracks. That happens, you get a rash. It becomes very irrational. Yeah, it's like wearing sandpaper paints. <laughs> <laughs> we can't be having that now, can we? No. Okay, I'm going to go. Okay. So All right. Sign off. sign off on the YouTube thing. I am, while you're okay. saying bye. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. Bye.